y'all what's up peace and love i am back again if you don't know who i am i am o'reilly um if you've been here before thank you for coming back if not yeah welcome to my channel today is the day where i give you a little studio tour of the shop the tattoo shop that i work in it's a private studio so it's me and three other people that work in here. It's like a smaller studio, but it's a private studio. So it's not really like a walk-in studio. You just like DM us and then you book with us and then yeah, you come in. But like from everybody that's come in, I've heard like this is like a really chill spot. This is one of the most like chillest places like to get tattooed. So yeah, I'll kind of be showing like everyone's stations, I guess, today. Um, yeah. So we'll get into it. I'm trying to make mine kind of cute because like mine's like the least cutest right now, I guess you could say. Uh -huh. So we'll get into it. We'll do we'll we'll, we'll do the whole thing, okay? And then you come into the shop and my mentor i swear she has the cutest stuff she knows how to set up stuff so cute there's like candies and stuff for people and then little candies yeah pocky sticks and then someone gifted her that that is so cute i think um i aspire to have my station looking like hers like come on that is the cutest station like i love her setup this is mine y'all don't make fun of me my little ring light but yeah we're getting there we're getting there and I just ordered a huge ink set so we're gonna do that I mean my trash can's kind of cool I have a bunch of stickers on it so it's kind of cute there's my chair and then I just bought this new bed this is like an $800 bed so it's supposed to be really good and then one of my clients got me this handmade thing thing like from Wednesday so cute and then I got this from an oddity shop and then here's some artwork oddity shop and then there's all the colors I own embarrassing I know I have like 60 colors coming in and there's my card iPad I keep all my cleanliness stuff right here and then my mentor made me this. It's the cutest thing ever. Okay, let me just take it. Off. Like y'all, okay. Let's look in the sun. Let's look in the sun. Okay. My mentor made this for me. It's my like where I put all my like caps and stuff on. I saran wrap it and yeah, I tattoo off of that. Super cute. She's so talented. She knows how to resin and do all that fun stuff so we keep it right on top of here and then all my little stuff is down here i need more caps i ordered more caps and then all my gloves and everything i need to tattoo and yeah it's a small studio i don't know how many square feet it is but um, this is another coworker, Jen Station. She's very talented. I don't have any of my own artwork up yet just because I haven't really been doing that, but I need to do my own artwork, like, for real. So here is Jen Station. They have a lot of art up. They're very talented. I don't have my art up, so, yeah. I gotta make art. I gotta be more inspired. They inspire me. But this is some really cool stuff that they made. They're very into like animals and just cool different things. I don't know. It's just really cool. They're an amazing tattoo artist as well. And then this is Bree Station. Bree is amazing. She likes realism too. This is her setup. She has cute colors too. And then here's her artwork. She has like the coolest artwork. They inspire me. I'm not like all with drawing and painting yet, but I'll get there. And then yeah, this is just like a panorama view of the shop. 
How many square feet is it, Star? Do you know? I forgot. Um, honestly, I don't remember. Yeah. But it fits all of us. And then my mentor just got here. That is Star. I'm going to put her Instagram in there as well. And then, yeah, I was showing them how cool your station was. And, yeah. This is basically it. I don't have any tattoos today, so I'm probably just going to sketch. And when I do have tattoos, I will try to, like, set it up to where y'all can watch me as well if y'all think that's cool. So, yeah. We'll talk soon, y'all. I'm back days later. Um, I didn't finish filming when I started filming the tour the first day because everyone started to come in and start tattooing, so I didn't want to interrupt. So I kind of wanted it to be kind of like isolated when I filmed in here, um, so I didn't disturb anyone. But I basically just wanted to say I'm just very grateful for how far I've come. I have so many people online saying, you know, I'm not good at tattooing, my tattoos are horrible, I can't do anything, um, learn something else, like, all I'll ever be is a, like, an SW, like, an S worker or whatever, um, there's a lot of people that don't want to take me serious, but, um, in order to take yourself serious, you have to do things. I was tattooing in my house and I felt like I could not be at my full potential tattooing in my house. I couldn't take my own self serious. So I was blessed to find a mentor star and she is helping me through my journey. Um, it is hard. It's a hard one. It is stressful most days. Um, but it's what I love. Like the OF stuff, all that, the camming, everything I do, that's cool. But this is my passion. This is, I want to own my own studio one day. Hopefully I can. And I mean, this is what I want to do. Um, I don't own my own style yet. I don't even really draw right now. I'm really kind of like stuck in like a purgatory thing where I like, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I know what I'm doing. If that makes sense. Um, I will put some pictures up of my tattoos if I can, if it doesn't look weird and then y'all can go follow my tattoo page but yeah this is basically just a little um studio shop tour and um i just want to say thank you all for those that are still here watching me i know y'all say i'm not boring but like i feel like i am but i mean i feel like we all feel like we're boring to ourselves sometimes but yeah um that's basically it i just i'll put some of my pictures up of my art of my tattoos i really need to start drawing again i need to get back into the fundamentals um i have a lot of people talking down on me but i just have to realize i have to just block that out um because i always i always get that i've never stopped getting hate since i've started becoming an online person or whatever and that's fine but i'm just gonna keep doing me i'm gonna keep manifesting i got myself into a shop five months ago i just had my little amazon machine just in my literally tattooing on the ground in my house and I didn't think I would be where I am right now um tattooing at the velocity that I am which I think I'm not the best tattooer no means do I think I am at all some people have told me I need to humble myself I think I'm too good I don't think I'm too good at all every time someone comes and gets a tattoo for me I let them know I am an apprentice I am still learning but it is best that I learn on human skin because that's what I learn best on even though I do practice on fake skin as well and I watch so many YouTube videos I watch lining shading all these things I just need to get better at doing it because I do find myself in downfalls and I do catch myself on like hey you need to research more you need to do more so that's what my goal for 2023 is is just to get my best that I can at tattooing and make it more my full-time thing because I mean I do maybe two three tattoos a week right now um which is not bad and it's not even about the money for me it's just what I truly love to do it's my it's, it is my passion I, when I'm tattooing I don't feel any of the pain that I feel in my regular existence of everyday life and that's just how I feel. I feel so zoned in, I feel at peace, I feel like that is my peace even though I do take medicine I feel like tattooing is my medicine and I only want to get better and you know for all those that say I'm messing up people's skin, that my tattoos are ugly, that they're never gonna go anywhere, that I'm gonna be nothing, I mean I'm just gonna keep doing me every day and um, I'm just gonna try to get better at my craft and that's all I can do. So now I'm at the shop. 
I'm gonna count inventory on my needles and see everything that I need. I have ink coming in, so I'm so excited about that. And um, I just wanna make beautiful art on people. And I just want this world to be a better place, honestly. I just want peace and love. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, peace and love. Have a good day. Um, please subscribe if you're not subscribed already, if you're just now seeing this. I am O'Reilly. Um, we'll talk soon, y'all. I am doing a Q&A video next. Um, I have a lot of questions from y'all, so uh, I'll be having that out for y'all soon. But have a good day. Bye.